been teaching exercise classes with the city of Richfield for many years. We decided to put together a quick express workout of 20 minutes. You can do this workout every day or once a week, whatever fits your schedule. Let's get started. We're gonna have some weights next to you in a chair and you can have some music off to the side if you can't hear mine. But we're gonna get started by just warming the body up. I want you to move, just move with me. All right, we're gonna start in marching. Gotta get that blood pumping through the whole entire body. Bring those arms up. Now take those arms together and push them out in, out in. Now take those arms all the way up above the shoulders. Now let's combine that. Let's pull them out together and up together. Good. Now let's bring one knee at a time up a little higher level. Get those hips, joints ready to go. Now let's do a kickback. Like you're gonna kick yourself back there. Get your thighs warmed up. Let's go back to a march. Keep those arms bent. Keep those hands opened up. And then take it out in front again about hip level. Dig your little heels into the ground. Get that heart rate elevated. You should start breathing a little harder, faster. And get march it out. Shoulders back, tummy in. Now take it to a roll in front and bring that roll up and bring it back down. And give me a little punch. Punch your frustrations out. All right, your heart rate should be going up. Body temperature elevated. Muscles are warm. Now let's put our feet shoulder width apart. And reach it right up above the shoulder. Now take it across the chest. Now take it up together. Just reach. We're going to slow it down and do a full range of motion for that arm and left arm and right arm. We'll be using weights, so we need to stretch out those deltoids. Upper back muscles, stretch them out. And the waistline, you're going to reach down to the side as if you're picking up your garbage bags off the ground. Now, put your hands right there on the shoulders. Bring the elbows in together, out together. And you're gonna do a teapot. Lift that elbow up, hold it. Opposite side, hold. Bring it back down, bring it back up to a march. A little warm up. Now take those arms in front and back. So we're gonna do a little cardio maybe two or three minutes, and then we're gonna do some weights and go back and forth. Now bring it up higher, crisscross. Take it into a roll. Keep marching up and get a little tired. Don't just sit down, just slow down. Now do a little punch. Up. Bring those arms back down. Keep those elbows bent. Open up those hands. Now you can take it out. Keep your knees bent. Bring it back in. Take it out. It's like you're stomping. Bring it back in. Let's take it to a swing. Right, left swing. Dig your heels right there into the ground. 
So your heart rate should be elevating right now, burning some calories. And let's lift the knee up and give your knee a slap. Now march it, march. And again, keep those elbows bent. Now take it out and in together. Take it up above the shoulder. Combine those motions and bring it out and up. A little bit of functional exercise in here. You need to reach up to your cupboards to grab things. Keep those muscles nice and loosened up. And a roll, roll. All right, there's about two to three minutes. We're gonna grab our weights. We're gonna bend, bend the knees, keep those hips forward, lift one at a time. About shoulder height, working on that upper back, deltoid, palms should be facing down with those weights. If you don't have weights at home, grab some soup cans. We're going to do one more. Good job. Now take it at shoulder height, palms out, lift, lift. Give me two more. Good job. Now ready? Take that one at a time, palms down. I used to call this slot machine pull, but they don't have pulls anymore on slot machines. And again, work in that deltoid area, upper back. One more. Good job. Now you're going to rest your weights on your shoulders, elbows out, tip the teeth up. Work in the waistline as we go. Elbow is going to try to hit that thigh. Now take those arms right down beside the thighs. Shoulder rolls up and down together. Up. Remember to lift from the shoulders. Straighten that upper back. Good job. Now we're going to take it outside, palms down, right to that thigh. Pull that shoulder height if you can. Make sure those elbows are relaxed, not locked up. We'll do a little aerobics here pretty soon, and then we'll do some thigh work also. So your heart rates are staying somewhat elevated right now during this part. And we're going to take our weights off to the side right now. And we're going to go back into an aerobic motion. By marching. Take it forward, forward, back, back. Now, if you don't feel secure, a little off, off balanced, you can hang on to your chair. Or you can march in place. We can go to the right for two. Left for two. Right for two. Left for two. Back we go. Then bring that knee up again and slap that knee. And again, if you feel a little bit off balance, go ahead, use one hand on the chair. Make that work out your own. Modify, take it down a notch, or bring it up a notch. 
Now march it out. Outside, punch one, two, three, four. Bring it up and punch. Back outside again. One more time up above. Now take those arms back down and march it out. We can do a stomp of out, out, in, in. And again, you don't feel comfortable doing that. March in place. Comes a hoe down. Elbows out or your washboard. Let's march it out. To a conga. My right foot steps out front and back. You decide how far. Hang on to that chair if needed. Now we're going to make a switch. Left foot steps out. Ready? Let's march it out. Forward, forward, back, back. Just marching it out. Swing those arms side to side. Exaggerate it. Take it outside. Your hands opened up. Now grab those weights. We're going to go into another part of this exercise class right now with weights and thighs. If you decide this is a little bit too rough for you, don't use the weights. Okay, take it outside with me, right? Same side. Knee is bent. One more. Let's go to the other side now. Make sure that chair is not in the way. Job. Feet shoulder width apart. We're going to work these quadriceps now. Shoulders back. Knees are bending. You don't want to lock them up. You want to keep them nice and soft. Hands on your hips with your weights. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Haul your weight right here on those thighs. Now come down a little lower if you can. Toes are pointed out. Shoulders are back. Now lift your little heels up. You're going to really feel this burning right here in your quads. Now a little bit deeper lunge. Don't lock those knees up. You should feel the burn. All right, march it back up. Right leg in front, left leg in back. Band together, straighten together. Okay. 
Switch it out now. Left in front, right behind. Bicep curl with this one. Remember, you don't have to use the weights. There we go. Now, on your hips with those weights, take it out right, left. We call that the pendulum. Shifting your weight hip to hip. March it back, take those weights off to the side again. Keep marching. A few minutes more, and we'll do a little bit of a cool down. Let's go. Out, out, in, in. How about one, two, three, kick. Kick. Kick, right kick. Now it's just a kick. Bring those arms a little bit lower. Back to a march. All right, we're going to go ahead and have a chair. We're going to do some stretching. I'd like you to take your arms outside, palms up, breathe in, exhale out, breathe in, exhale out, arms both outside, palms are up, right arm up by the right ear, left arm, left ear. Shoulder rolls. Arms extended outside. Good job. Full range motion. It's like you're doing a front crawl. Stretching out those thighs. Put your heel on the ground. Slide down towards that ankle. Back up. Slide down to the opposite ankle, ankle back up. Right foot on top of the left knee, sit up nice and tall. Pull forward from the hips. Neck and back lined up. Back up, switch sides. Just stretch out those hips and thighs. Forward we go. Try not to pull your shoulders forward. Bring it back up. Take both hands to the left. Both hands right. Back to center. Good job. Take a deep breath. Breathe in. Hands together, palms together, and exhale. Thank you for being with me today. Try to use this workout at least once a week, if not two or three times. See you next time. Thank you.